Hey guys, Phil Monteleone, the book peddler here, and I'm going to give you a little update on um, on my new building, the progress coming along, and uh, the, the future plans for it. So I hope to have the downstairs open in a couple months, and so I'm just going to take you over there and, and, and show you around. Okay, so here we are, and this whole porch got painted. My parents helped me paint it. They did do a majority of the work. My mom cleared off the um, the original walkway here, as you can see, beautiful big slabs. I hung some flower pots up. I'm gonna get a writing something on the black here. Um, so that was cool. Painted this uh, little walkway upstairs as well, and I'm gonna get some steps put here. The one thing is, is I gotta replace this wood. A lot of water collects as they kept building up the roadway. It, all these houses become lower and they dip down, but nice paint job, huh? So I'll show you inside. I do have to replace some of the the glass here. Let's take you inside. We cleared out, haul, we hauled loads of garbage out. There's some more right there. Painted all the inside white. I'm not going to paint the blue. There's that big farm table. What I'm going to do over here is this is going to be my processing center, basically. Um, as picks come in, they'll be unloaded here, and I'll process them. And this is where the uh, computers, scales, everything will be for shipping out. I bought these up at Brickhouse Salvage and Antiques. My mom did. Thank you, Steve. And uh, so the books will file through here and out the door for shipping. So that's the sh little shipping center. Oh, I also got to show you this sign. I hung it up on the wall so that you guys could see. It's a double-sided sign that a friend of mine, Kelsey Fiore, thank you, Kelsey, um, donated the sign. It came from an old bookstore in Sydney. And this will probably be hung out on the, on the front porch somewhere. Really awesome. It's all uh, it's wood and um you know all carved in it's beautiful sign so very happy with that now what I, the other plans are so i'm gonna have rolling bookcases i have these filing cabinets that are going upstairs this wall will be books and prints let me get over here these cases i recently bought at an auction check them out i'll show you them quick this is beautiful so i i'm redoing the main shop that i'm in and um these are this is one added and that's the other one really beautiful style and uh they have keys they have locks on the tops and bottoms R really nice really big so that's gonna let me zoom out that's gonna be a beautiful part of the redoing of my main shop um we all and this whole area here guys there's a stage behind uh, behind there this this whole area here is going to be a children's section. And where um, somebody I know is going to do uh, uh, reading, and there's the stage, reading for the kids. There'll be a lot of kids' books, and if they come to a reading, they'll get one for free. Uh, so a little reading hour. And don't worry, there's not going to be men with skirts and clown makeup reading to your children. It's going to be a decent thing going on here, and a beautiful thing. Um, so... There'll also be, I'll be running fire sales out of here. As you can see, we've been organizing the back room. Got the paperback rack in. And we're going to run dollar sales out of here. And then up front, there'll probably be $2 books, $5 books. So that that's exciting. And I hope to have this open in a couple months. Let me take you upstairs. <clears throat> what I ended up doing was purchasing... A lot of shelving very recently from a library that went out and here it is so we're gonna set up this up here clean this up I'm gonna have hire in a lister that's gonna be positioned over here somewhere to do listings photography all of that stuff and this will be closed off to the public this will be um, where I store the internet books uh, but um uh, you know, if I like you, you can come up and, and peruse. I don't mind. So anyhow, if you guys enjoyed the quick tour. Um, it's a lot of work. I'm splitting time between both buildings and trying to get things done. So as I said, I hope to open it in a couple months. Um, the electric work keeps getting pushed back. So that's been frustrating because I obviously need power over here. And then look at this. 
that window blew out so that's getting replaced i have a board that goes over it so that that was something but yeah it's a it's a lot of time but it is coming together so that's about it people were asking for an update i, I figured i'd give you a quick update and i think this is just going to be a really enjoyable uh, uh place to be and a nice little area to host small events as well so um wish me luck i'm going to try to get this downstairs prepared in a couple months got a lot of work to do but i hope everybody all of you have been well out there i appreciate all your support check out the links below if you'd like until next time we'll see you guys